Welcome to this automated flood irrigation project with Watch Technologies. This project is located near El Centro, California. This system's hardware includes 24 canal gates, one check gate, one base station, and 12 moisture present sensors. Here's how this particular system works. Farmer orders water to be delivered from the irrigation district. At a scheduled time, the district opens the gate from their canal and sends an allotted amount of water down this concrete ditch for an allotted period of time. Once water enters this ditch, there's a moisture present sensor halfway down the ditch near the check gate. When water touches the sensor, the sensor tells the system to wake up and that water is available. The system then goes through a procedure to initiate the first irrigation, which is close the check gate to raise the water level, then open gates one and two, and lastly confirm that all other ditch gates are closed. This system runs two gates per section, now that the system is actively irrigating in the first section, water from gates 1 and 2 make its way down section 1 of the field. Eventually water runs into a moisture present sensor. These sensors are roughly three quarters of the way down the field. The goal is to situate the sensors in a spot where the farmer knows if he closes the gates, the water will still make its way to the end of the field with as little waste as possible. Once the sensors get wet, the sensor tells the system to switch irrigation from section 1 to section 2. With this notification, gate 3 and 4 open and gates 1 and 2 close. Water then begins to flood out of gates 3 and 4 down section 2 to the moisture present sensor. This sequence continues all the way down the ditch using gate sensor communication. This system irrigates roughly 100 acres in 4 days using 8 hour sets per section. They won't have to come back to irrigate this field for 10 or so days, and this is all in 110 degree temperatures. By using flood irrigation, they can get away with this by getting good moisture penetration into the soil with less evaporation. By pushing a higher volume of water for shorter periods of time, you push water deeper into the subsoil. Automating the system has helped this farm save time, labor, waste less water, and allow them to focus their time and energy on more important projects. To learn more about this equipment and how we can help your operation, please visit gravityirrigation.com.